And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And it's the opening contest for the two teams in this Champions League season. It's Juventus up against Stuttgart. Well, thanks, Derek. As always, when you're playing your first match, there's going to be a little bit of anxiety and tension. But these are two decent teams, so I'm expecting a really good game today. Italian football going with this starting 11. Bremer plays alongside Federico Gatti in central defence and the striker today is Dusan Vlaovic. set up as a 4-4-2 which means the front two will need to be clever with their combination play dynamic with their movement and energetic with their closing down I'm looking forward to seeing them play here today Turam. Interception to snuff out the danger. Vagnoman. Undav. Potentially a chance to do damage on the flank for Juve. promise can he take advantage and caught by the keeper Vagnoman Angelo Stiller Maximilian Mittelstedt Hermedine Demirovic just knocking it around looking to carve out a chance The cross is on. And a precise challenge just when it was required. Yildiz. Okay, friend Turam. Dusan Vlahovic. Very timely interception. No man and moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here. Can he finish? Great defending. comes to nothing in the end really should have made more of that
He read the situation defensively and did his job. Cup Mainers. Cambiasso. It's with Cup Mainers. Vlaovic. Showing patience as well as persistence in the builder. Decisive in the tackle. And the throw in here. Vagnoman. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Cup Mainers. Turan. Well, they must exercise caution. Can he put them in front? Watching him. And into the back of the net. Well, they paid the price for their negligence. They let them come at them. And now it's a different equation. As the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Ermedin Demirovic. And it's with Mittelstedt. A super tackle and they've won possession. Fairly easy for the referee to spot that deflection. So now a throw in. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Could play it in. Well, that's splendid play. Dusan Vlahovic using the wide route could be beneficial for Juve but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end Maximilian Mittelstedt Jamie Leveling Undav moving the ball effectively oh he's given us away Juventus but nothing comes of it good defending it was Carazor. and it's with Wagnermann well half time coming up shortly and the home side on top Stuart interested to get your critique yes they've defended really well all over the pitch their work rate and discipline has been excellent but any drop in tempo and this lead could easily slip away Well, passing moves like this will keep confidence levels up. Nicolas Gonzalez. The fans are shouting, shoot! And quick thinking defensively. Ermedin Demirovic. Labeling. Undav. And defensive play to be applauded. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. He's got space. And there goes the half-time whistle. That will do it for the first half here in Turin. Well, Turn Cup Miners had a lot to say for himself in the first half. Stuart, your take as regards his performance? Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play.
start of the second half here in Turin tonight. Angelo Stiller. He could pick out a teammate. Federico Gatti. Cambiasso. Vlaovic. Failure to keep the ball by the Bianconeri. Ermedine Demirovic. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Bremer. Dusan Vlahovic. The Bianconeri have given us away. Maximilian Mittelstedt. Chance to cross. A fine use of the ball. But then the one that fails to hit its target. Can they hit on the break? But they took care of the situation defensively. Denis Undav. Another chance to whip it in here. Juventus will have to throw it back in play. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes, and now both sides will make personnel switches. Bremer. Locatelli with it. Danilo. Danilo Kefren Turan the object of the exercise from Juventus is to get it forward that's what they're doing but quick thinking defensively well let's see what they have in store for them on the break Undav and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. It's a perfect challenge. Danilo. It's with Cop Mainers. Feeding it through. Well, very effective play, and they might be onto something. Vlaovic, the crowd encouraging him to take it on, and the keeper getting across to stop it. And the Juventus personnel change here. for the short corner Danilo delivered into the area here and he failed to get it away properly can he make it count oh magnificent reaction it's a substitution for Juventus
Playing it in. Well, far from the ideal header. And the goalkeeper had it all the way. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Now the attack fizzled out. Just ten minutes remaining here. Dusan Vlahovic. Juventus keep possession and it's positive possession. What can they do from this position? Let's go finish it! And able to close down the shots. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. Delivering it. And that's very confident goalkeeping in not easy circumstances. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left and the margin just one. Well, time is of some concern. Can they level matters? That's the clearance that was needed. doing well to regain possession oh that's splendid play ball is loose good piece of defending not a huge chunk of added time one minute Federico Gatti. It's with Cup Mainers. And there goes the final whistle. Well, they've got to make up for lost time now. A defeat at home on match day one, Stuart. Well, it's not the start they wanted. It puts them under a bit of pressure going into the next game. They need to bounce back now. Well, two and Cup Mainers, as usual, was difficult to play against and deserves very high marks, which, of course, are coming his way. Yeah, good performance and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today.